Productivity is all the rage, especially in the world of creativity. Doing more with less is the pipe dream of every creative pro that has to fit increasingly more into a standard 24-hour day. And if you, like me, are becoming more and more frustrated with productivity tips, then tools and gurus and all kinds of things that don't realistically either add to my understanding or my mastery of how to be more productive, meaning how to live a fruitful, balanced life while growing my business and career, then stick around and let's just talk about it. Hi, I'm Maynard and I create learning experiences for professional creatives that are working really hard to find their voice, grow their confidence and just do the type of work that will not only make a meaningful impact but also generate a realistic income. So first and foremost, what is productivity? Productivity isn't just about following morning routines, about drinking shakes and using more apps or just being ultra disciplined. It is not about just mentally deciding to just do more work either. Surprisingly, sometimes being productive means actually doing less. Ultimately, productivity is about achieving more, but in a smarter way. Productivity doesn't boil down to a simple output measure. It's a dynamic equation that multiplies these two things, effectiveness and efficiency. Effectiveness is about doing the right things. It's about focusing on tasks that truly matter. Efficiency, on the other hand, is about doing those same things, but in the best possible way. Mistaking the one for the other can lead to many problems and pitfalls. If we're solely focused on efficiency, we might find ourselves optimizing the things that don't really contribute to our end goals. On the flip side, being hyper-focused on effectiveness without considering efficiency might lead to burnout from working on things that in the end don't make any significant difference. However, when we understand the distinction between the two, we can start working in an impactful way. By striking a balance, we pinpoint tasks that truly matter and then we tackle them with a streamlined approach. The synergy between these two mindsets allows us to achieve meaningful results without spinning our wheels or end up just drowning in our own work. Effectiveness is all about bringing your goals to life. It's about choosing the right tasks that align with your objectives and the things you want to bring about in the world. And instead of getting bogged down in busy work, effectiveness directs your efforts towards tasks that propel you forward. And this forward thinking approach demands a leadership mindset. It's about seeing the bigger picture and steering your actions accordingly. Remember, even the highest degree of operational efficiency won't necessarily salvage a project that lacks purpose. Effectiveness is the compass that ensures every task you undertake is a meaningful step towards your end goal. If you want to instantly improve your effectiveness, here are some key steps towards achieving your goals. One, you need to clarify your purpose. Understanding the why behind your actions provides clear direction ensuring that every task aligns with every corresponding outcome. Secondly, you need to define what your goals and objectives are. Setting concrete and measurable goals gives you a roadmap to follow. It helps you to stay on track and just avoids any meaningless work. Finally, you need to figure out how to do strategy right. Developing a clear thought out strategy allows you to approach your work with a plan. It increases your chances of, of success by eliminating all kinds of haphazard actions. Efficiency, on the other hand, evolves around making the most of what you have to work with right now. It's about doing things in the right way. It's about conserving resources and ensuring every single action counts in the present moment. In addition to being a well-developed leader, efficiency requires strong management skills as it involves optimizing your workflow to achieve immediate results. Remember once again that even the best ideas can fall flat if they can't be executed efficiently. Efficiency acts as the bridge between your brilliant concepts and their real-world impact. This makes sure that your efforts today translate into meaningful outcomes tomorrow. If you seek to rapidly increase your efficiency, here are my top three strategies for streamlining your work and doing more with less. One, you need to clarify roles and responsibilities. If you're working in a team, clearly defining roles ensure that each member knows their tasks, it eliminates duplication and confusion, and it just creates an environment for smoother workflows to flourish. Secondly, you need to refine all systems and processes. Streamlining your workflow by refining systems helps to reduce bottlenecks that eliminates unnecessary steps, leading to work that happens faster and easier while in the end accomplishing more. Lastly, 
you need to master technology. Harnessing the power of your tools to automate routine tasks will save time, it will reduce errors, and ultimately, it'll boost your overall efficiency. In the quest for productivity, remember that effectiveness takes the lead in the sense that it shapes your path and your purpose. Efficiency, its trusted companion, only optimizes that journey. Real value arises from being effective first, while secondly, efficiency ensures that you can perform and produce at volume. Balancing these dynamics is the key to working less while you're accomplishing more, which in essence is the textbook definition of being productive. If this was at all meaningful to you, consider clicking on any of these other videos that might be of interest or even subscribing to the channel and please enable your notifications so you know when we're releasing any future episodes. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next week.